Hey everybody and welcome back to Mondays with me, Dr. Crystal. Yes, I'm wearing a mask in my own house because we are close contacts and we're not trying to pass around COVID. Say hi guys. Hi. What up? So we're on day four, so far so good. Hopefully we don't pick it up, but uh, fingers crossed. So right now I have five basketball games to cover in the next six days. The first one is tonight, obviously not ready for it yet, but I'm gonna take you guys along for the ride. Let's go. All right, ladies and gentlemen, fit check for the game. I'm covering men's basketball tonight. They don't tell me what I have to wear, so I get to pick what I wanna wear. We went with the green top, the navy pants. They look black here though, and some Cole Hans. What do you think, peanut gallery? Yeah. yeah, that's what I thought. We're looking good. If we go, uh, five, how many games did I say I have? Five. If we go five for five during this stretch, I think I might have to do like a giveaway or something because that would be awesome. Say hi. All right, so the guys are playing NC State tonight. Are we going to win? Yes. Obviously. Yes, they, they have to say that. So I said if we win, if we win all five games, the girls and the guys in the next six days, then I'm gonna give something away to these people. Okay. I didn't wear any rings today because the guys give really hard dabs. <laughs> it hurts me. No. The girls only give high fives, so. Yeah. <laughs> this is number one. All right. What's everyone's prediction for the game? This is Lee, our nutritionist. W's all around, baby. What score? How many are we gonna win by? I'll divert that to Tyler. I think we're gonna win by 12 points. I'm calling 77-65. This is Tyler, one of our sports medicine fellows. I think we're gonna win by nine points. 50 to 59, low scoring game. Right. Oh, you want it? Oh, yeah. yes, we're still rolling. So after much consideration, I'm gonna go with seven points, but we're obviously winning. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> It's just after 11 and I just got in my car. It was a late one tonight, started at nine. I'm exhausted. We got the win. Um, usually after games, well actually always after games, I stay um, and see anybody who needs to be seen. Nobody needed to be seen tonight, which is a great night when there's no injuries, nobody's sick and we get the win. So good night. Uh, that's first of five games and I will check in with you guys tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow the women play Syracuse, so let's go two for two. All right, I just finished clinic. This is actually an early game. Last night was late, started at nine. This one's early, it starts at six. Usually games start at like seven, so I got done with clinic at five. The girls like me there like 45 minutes to an hour early, so um, I'm going to head over there right now. Quick fit check. Um, unlike when I cover the men, when I cover the women, uh, they tell me what what top they want me to wear. So they said white today, so I'm wearing white. I changed into this after clinic because I'm too messy to, to wear white just regularly. It would have been a mess by the end of the day. So I got the white shirt, got gray pants, Irish socks, and the Cole Hans again. Like I said, we're playing Syracuse. I think we're gonna get the dub. I'm ready to go. I think I just clapped my hands a lot, but um, are you ready to go with me? Let's go. All right, so we are headed across campus to the basketball game. Ah, everyone's getting out of work now, so it's busy. So yeah, I do not work on the athletic side of campus. I'm actually completely on the other side of campus. So um, the football stadium, the basketball arena, soccer field, baseball field, everything. Every, all the sports stuff is on the south side of campus and we are on the north side of campus. So um, it's not very far. It takes like three minutes, but I have to drive over there. So that's what I'm doing now. Back at right. it again with the basketball games. Back at it again. <laughs> um, I think we're gonna win by eight. 
Well, I know we're gonna win, and I'm gonna go for 13. Ooh, um, so okay, I'll video. go for 15. 16. I'm going <laughs> seven. Let's go. <laughs> It's like 8.40, walking out to my car. Got another dub, we're two for two. I think you guys might get a giveaway, but the, the hardest games are to come. The men got Duke on Monday, the women got NC State on Tuesday, so those are gonna be the hardest ones. Um, yeah, so we had a few people to see afterwards. Got it done, everyone's good, we're good. Got that, we! But anyways, I'm gonna go home and go to bed. I have a meeting at seven tomorrow, so day ends late, day starts early. It's a day in the life. All right, it's Friday. No, it's Saturday. Time for game three, fit check. I'm with the guys again tonight. They're playing UVA. He didn't want to be in it, but this is my father-in-law. And we are wearing green pants, navy top, Notre Dame shoes, Under Armour, because we have to. Get that dub. All right, just got to the parking lot. It is freezing. My car says it's 20 degrees outside, but it's still light out, which is nice. It's usually dark when I get to games. Um, as I said, it's Saturday. When you work in athletics, there's rarely full days off. Like it's still a chill day. This is my favorite part of my job. I get to go cover games, watch the game, hopefully not do much work. That's always a good day in sports medicine when nobody gets hurt and you get the win. I think I already said that earlier in this video, but um, yeah, my goal is to go in there, do nothing. Hopefully the guys play well. Um, they were saying on the radio the other day, uh, we have never beat Virginia in regular season ACC play. So uh, Virginia's down this year and we're up. So I'm hoping we can get the win today and keep the streak going. Because right now we're two for two. I know I said if we win them all, we'll do a giveaway. So I, I don't know, I might have to have to think of something to give away if we keep winning. Irish win by nine. I think I said that last time. Twelve. Twelve? Joey. How much are we gonna win by? Three for three, let's go! I just got back in the car, it's 8.30. I gotta get home, I haven't eaten dinner yet, but I'm super pumped. It was a good win. We were winning pretty much the whole game and then tried to give it away at the end, but we pulled it out. No major injuries, everyone's good, knock on wood. Be back here tomorrow, the girls play Boston College, so I'm gonna go home, eat, get some sleep tonight and be ready. The game's at two tomorrow, so. Um, I will catch you guys tomorrow. I don't know if these clips are too quick. I hope you guys are enjoying this. I don't know. Whatever. We're doing it. Does, I guess it doesn't really matter if you like it because we're doing it. See you tomorrow. All right. We are ready for game three. There's Heather's mom behind us. And the women play Boston College today. It's a rematch. We lost by two last time. Heather, will you take us through the fit check? What are we wearing today? Remember, the I, I get instructed on what to wear to the women's games. We got the white button up, no collar, looks really nice. Feminine fit, looks great. Nice navy, fitted slacks, looking good. Some winter socks on, and then comfy Cole Haan shoes for work. Thanks. Looking great. What do you think, Nance? How um, do I look? You look like you're a winner. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Irish by 20. 23. 23. How many are we going to win by? 2-4. 20s. 
seven. Let's go! Welcome to halftime snack time. Snack of choice. Snack of choice. Oh, we have to I think I said earlier that this was game three, but it's definitely game four in our series and we are four for four. Let's go. Irish basketball taking care of business this week and I'm happy. What can I say? It's 4.30. I'm out of there. It's still light out. I'd have to say this is a pretty good Sunday. Taking care of business, I couldn't be happier. So we are four for four so far. We got the two hardest ones left. Uh, the ladies have NC State on Tuesday, which is gonna be a tough one. And tomorrow our guys take on Duke. So it's gonna be a fun two days. I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, we're gonna fit check in a second, but I realized I completely forgot to tell you guys what happened with me being a close contact. So we were all close contacts in our house because my sister tested positive while she was staying with us. And we wore masks around each other for five days. We tested a few times on home tests, but we all got PCRs on day five. And somehow, I don't know how, but we were all negative. So I got cleared from my close contactness, which is great because I can go to all these games. I was worried that uh, this video was gonna get cut short because if I tested positive, I obviously can't go. But anyways, today is the Duke game and I'm so freaking pumped. Um, our guys team, Notre Dame men's basketball, fighting Irish, we're taking on Duke today and I'm super pumped. Um, I forget what Duke's ranked right now, but they're in the top 10. We are on the bubble as far as making it into the NCAA tournament as of right now. So we need this win. Our best win right now is against Kentucky, which is a great win, but we need a little bit more than that to kind of bring us to the next level and guarantee our spot in the tournament. Our men's team has actually not made the tournament since I started here, so I'm super excited for them. I want to see them get this. I want the seniors to have that moment of being able to play in a tournament game, so hopefully they'll get it done. But anyways, today's a green out game. Actually, today and tomorrow are green out games, and I only have two uh, well, actually, I have a polo, but I only have two long sleeve green shirts. And so um, this is one of them today. We got green on the top. We got blue pants. I wear a lot of blue pants. I went with socks that got that have some green in them. And then the Cole Hans that I've been wearing like every time. We actually have some green like Notre Dame Under Armour shoes, but they're so tacky. They're so tacky. I couldn't wear them. I put them on this morning and it's just too much. Maybe I'll wear them tomorrow, but probably not. But anyways, it's game time. Let's go. Go Irish. Irish by three. Ah. Irish by seven. Irish by five. How much are we gonna win by? Uh, seven. All right, we got two sevens. Let's go Irish. That was tough to watch. We didn't play our game. We weren't on. We couldn't hit our shots. Not gonna beat a top 10 team without hitting shots. I think we had like 14 points the first half, but I think the guys will bounce back. They have a big one later this week on Wednesday. Um, they play Miami away, so that'll be a huge one. Hopefully they can get that one, but sadly our streak is over in this set of games. Um, still pumped for the women's game tomorrow against NC State. I think it'll be a really good game, but uh, that was a tough loss tonight. 
We're okay. We're okay. I think we're going to get Duke in the ACC tournament, and we're going to beat him in the tournament. Calling it now. Mark it. You guys mark it. It's going to be on video, so you'll know that I said it. And when it happens, I said it. All right, I had to run out of clinic pretty quickly because I have to run over to the training room to see an athlete from a different sport before the game. So I forgot to do a fit check because I was rushing, but I mean, it's it's not exciting. I told you yesterday, it's another green out game, so I'm wearing green, it's quarter zip. Um, yeah, I'm driving across campus right now. Um, and navy pants, I wear a lot of navy pants, but I promise I have more than one pair, so it's not like I'm just like, wearing the same pants every single day but I do wear a lot of navy pants so that's happening I'm gonna wear my Cole Haan's again and I have some polka dot green socks on because Irish wear green today so um yeah so we're headed over there now it's actually five o'clock the game's not till seven I'll usually get there about an hour early but like I said today I have somebody else I need to see so um, I'm gonna get over there, see that patient, and hopefully get back to getting some notes done um, that I had to not finish at clinic because I had to come over here. So anyways, here we go. Today's a big one. Um, I, need, I need a bounce back in my morale from last night because that was, that was just tough. So let's go, go Irish. Last game in the series, Irish by five, seven. Eight. Let's go! That was insane. Oh my gosh, we got the win. Freaking awesome, I'm so happy about that. Also, like, the craziest thing happened today. So like, most games I do nothing. You saw, like, during all this whole group of games, I've really had to do nothing during or after the games. Today, we had three doctors at the game, and within, like, a minute, we've had, we had three injuries, and we were all having to do something. Like, I had to go out on the court twice, and also we had a doctor run down from the stands who was an eye specialist when somebody got hit in the eye. It was crazy. Like it was literally crazy. And so obviously stuff to do after, evaluate people and everything. Um, I think everybody's gonna be good. Everybody's hype on adrenaline after winning that game. So hopefully everyone's still feeling good tomorrow. We'll have to see. But ah, that was amazing. Five for six, I mean, I, I can't be too mad at that. That was awesome. But anyways, on that note, it's late and it's a Tuesday night, so I'm gonna go home and go to bed. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to give it a like, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you next time.